Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commencing the 24th of June 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, find your purpose, create your future, to raise your consciousness, step out onto your spiritual path from the spiritual closet, to know who you truly are, uh, find where you are supposed to be in this life, to spread your wings and soar and take charge of your destiny. Now this week we're going to be using the Goddess Guidance Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. And as always before we get into this week's reading, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you so much. And with that in mind, don't forget on the 13th of July, I'm going to be down at Little Hall Shard in Horton Kirby at the Feed Your Soul Wellbeing event offering angelic Reiki taster with an angel oracle card reading. So if you want to um, book a session with me in advance to make sure you um, have that session with me, then please do contact me direct. Otherwise, I will see you um, at the event. Um, the link uh, to get tickets um, I'll put in the comments and there are workshops going on as well. And of course, Angel Wings membership will be open in July, August, and it'll be wonderful for you to join our brilliant community. Um, you can find out more in, again, in the links, in the comments. And I'm going to be obviously starting Angelic Reiki practice, well, sorry, Angelic Reiki workshops starting again in September. And you can do all of them or just one or two of them, um, however you want to connect with the Angelic Crowns. So as always, I'll give the cards a quick cleanse and a bless. What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing the 24th of June 2024? Who's watching this? Okay, so we've got three cards that have decided they want to come out this week. So we have got Mary Magdalene, Unconditional Love, Love Yourself, Others and every situation no matter what the outward appearances may be and leap of faith take a risk and put your heart's true desire into action isn't that beautiful and we actually celebrated Anne at this summer solstice Guinevere true love the romantic stirrings in your heart have propelled the universe to deliver great love to you. Isn't that a beautiful card? And I've never actually had this card come out before on any readings I've done. So it's absolutely amazing um, that, uh, that she has come out. So obviously we've got a theme of love going on this week. Um, so what the uh, cards are saying to you this week is that you need to stay in the energy of unconditional love of that um, energy of knowing who you are, who you are truly meant to be, how much love you can give out in the world and know that you are truly loved. Know that there is love around you. Sometimes it may not feel it, but know that love does exist. It is there, whether that's through um, physical love, emotional love, spiritual love, angelic love. It is there for you. Um, so... It's a very, it's a very easy for us to say love others, but it's a lot harder for us to love, love ourselves. And you really do, and to be able to love others, you need to love yourself truly, first of all. And you need to look at other people. It doesn't matter what their outward appearance can be. They are true love underneath and they need that unconditional love. And I know it's really difficult to see that, especially if there's someone that we've got issues with. But you need to see past that and see that there is a spark of divine there for them. And if you can hold that love within you and see that spark of love within you, you can see it so much easier in them. And know that the universe, you know, is surrounding you in love. And that if you want to take that risk to do something out of the ordinary, then do it through a heart of love. Do it through the love of the universe, of angels. You know, true, true friends and family will always back you um, if it's for your highest good and allow you to make mistakes if you need to make mistakes. 
But if you're doing something from love that feels courageous for you, then do it. Take that step this week, that leap of faith. What do you want to do? How do you want to do it? Go out and do it with love, with joy, with happiness. You know, your heart's desire is really important. You know, all this love is really about the heart this week. So stay in your heart for everything. That's dealing with people, with everyday situations, with yourself, literally everything this week. You have to, you have to work from your heart. You have to be in your heart and connect with that unconditional love um, within there. And surround yourself in the colours of love, you know, reds and pinks, roses, you know, all those things. Treat yourself to um, uh, baths, um, pampering, really love yourself this week because when you're in that state of love, you will send that love out to other people and they will feel that love and then they'll send that love out and then eventually love will go out all across, all across the world. Um, but yeah, that, you know, this week really is all about unconditional love, you know, loving yourself and every other living thing, no matter who or what they are. Taking that leap of faith, what is your heart's desire? And know that, you know, those romantic stirrings in your heart, that is the unconditional love. If need be, read a romantic novel, watch a romantic film, just allow that romantic love to, to well inside you and that will help you connect to that unconditional love that we all have, that, you know, that is our birthright, that we forget we have. We have to know that we are loved unconditionally, not just by physical love, but by energetic love. So really that's all um, the cards are telling me for you this week. As always, this is my interpretation of the cards and you may get a completely different interpretation. And one card may stand out more than the others and that is absolutely fine. You go with what resonates with you. So the cards again are Mary Magdalene, unconditional love. Love yourself, others and every situation, no matter what the outward appearance may be. See beyond the um, external. N, leap of faith. Take a risk and put your heart's true desire into action. What do your, does your heart say you want for your highest, best good? Do it this week. Guinevere, true love. The romantic stirrings in your heart have propelled the, the universe to deliver great love to you. Know that love is coming to you, whether that's from another person, from the angels, from the universe, from your higher self. That love is there. So please do let me know in the comments uh, whether these cards resonated, whether the message resonated, whether you've got your own interpretation. I always reply to everyone who comments or messages me direct. And don't forget that um, if you uh, want to connect with me, you can do. Um, I'm uh, just send me an email, go by my website, you know, check out uh, the uh, Feed Your Soul event on 13th of July, check out Angel Wings, it's a brilliant community, I love um, being, um, holding the space for everyone and connecting with everyone there, and they all connect with each other and have some brilliant conversations, some great friendships have um, come about from it as well, and of course uh, check out Angelic Reiki, I love not just practicing it but also teaching it. Um, it really lights me up and I love seeing people, uh, the students that have uh, trained with me go on and do so many great things. And of course, don't forget to check out my show, Angels and Destiny, which if you're watching this on Sunday, is taking place tomorrow, the 20, Monday 24th of June at 8pm UK time. If you're watching later in the week, then please do watch the replay. I've got the wonderful Sarah Dawkins as my guest and I'm really looking forward to that conversation and look forward to you joining us. Have a wonderful week. Stay in the energy of love. Take care. Bye.